Yeah, I would say like even some of the songs I heard like where the messaging was very strong politically and socially, like it kind of brought me back to like some of those older songs you're saying, like Sly and Family Stone, like even like Marvin Gaye when they speak about like what's just happening around them. And like I really appreciated mm-hmm. that kind of that kind of like commentary on what what what's going on, but like in a soulful, funky way. Thank you. I, it's a lot of I think I've always wanted to do it, but um, it felt like too much of a responsibility. And also just like you said, it's been done in such like genius ways that I mm. couldn't even dare try to, Oh, I'm going to do like a, what's going on on my own. Hell no, girl, you can't do that. You're not loving <laughs> gay. But by seeing it as me telling my story, it felt more natural and less pressure. Uh, Cause it's just me telling my truth and not necessarily um, feeling the responsibility of reflecting the world because I, I don't, so many people can do it better than me. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I think you did, <laughs> think you did a pretty good job here, and I think you also found a way to Thank tell you. it from your own kind of perspective. Because, like you said, Marvin Gaye, Sly, they're telling it, but it's also from like kind of a male perspective, and you you represent this yeah, whole other oh, side of true. it that you don't necessarily get from like older older artists. 